Hello, 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 and we are back. And I am, to use the the, the best term, gagging <laughs> to jump back into some vaults. Um, so let's get ourselves ready to vault. I didn't like using the term gagging. Uh, actually, though, we could probably do with doing one thing first. Uh, which would be maybe making a new super pick. Um, I'm considering it. Considering. Uh, do I care enough about that? It's a tough one. It is a tough one. Um, let's keep getting everything else while we think. So we want to make a pick. That's fine. And then we can come over here and just start making this fast. And then if we go get some emeralds, we can make it the best it can be. Uh, I did some trading off camera, just so that we wouldn't have to waste our time a huge amount every time we needed emeralds. Um, so we want efficiency, uh, silk touch, and unbreaking. There we go. I think that is fairly reasonable now. Um, let's do this, let's put this away, let's put these away because we'll take vault meat obviously. Insta mine these, lovely. Let's grab some vault meat and then let's make our crystal. Uh, on sure. um, we're still, of course, looking for knowledge. Uh, well, not, not yeah, knowledge. We need to aim for 162 essence, which is actually probably less because I didn't include these. Um, 16 vault diamonds we have. Uh, and 32 Beniotite we have. So we're just kind of looking for somewhere in the realm of like 100 Essence. Um, so let's get going. This will also be our first vault without protection, which is crazy. Uh, okay, so Diorite, Sugarcane, Copper, and then Honeycomb. But that's a nice quick vault now. Uh, all done. Boom. Hit that. Let's get our reward. Then we'll whiz all of this away. Lovely, and let's just get vaulting. Uh, da, 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 da. I, I made some of these blast furnaces because I every so often I'll come onto this world and I'll do some like mining. Like now we've got 2,713 uh, <laughs> chromatic ore. I've, uh, I'm quite successful at, um, I've just put them away, that's fine. I'll take them from here for now. Um, I'm quite successful at mining right now. <laughs> Uh, and with Fortune 5, obviously, you get a lot of stuff. Okay, so we've got our food, sword, pick an axe and stuff. Let's, let's do that. Uh, food, bam, 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 bam. I think we've got everything we need, so let's just go. So, no protection. It's an elixir vault, okay. Oh, and bonus chest. Bonus living and bonus food. Bonus living is perfect for us, because actually all we're kind of here for is the knowledge. Um, so that is real great. So let's just get going. Oh, Wendar, seize the opportunity. Mana regen. So if we finish this vault also, we'll get some bonuses from Wendar. This is a very good vault for us. Yeah, we could... Oh, it's through here. Literally. Uh... Let's see if we can... Where's the swan at? It might be up the stairs somewhere. Yeah, there it is. Uh, let's just quickly... Oh, shoot! Break this. Uh, with whatever we can. It's fine. It's not fine. Get away. This pick's not as quick. Oh, shoot. Shoot. Okay, I think we're good. I think we've managed to secure ourselves in here. So I've learned what these are now. So discovered speed one. So these will be potion modifiers. Um, so they will basically modify potions for it. I'm just checking for more spawners. So when we upgrade our potions to the next, um, to the next tier, we'll actually get um, to apply those if we want, which is quite cool um, because we could definitely do with better stuff, but we don't use the potions that much, to be fair, either. 
Um, let's be very real with ourselves. Uh, heal, because I know you're here. Lovely. This has been quite a nice room. Uh, it's done us quite well. Uh, lovely, and boom. Let's go across. Let's go across. Speed is key. I'll loot when I find one. But I'd rather find one. Mm, this looks like a... Oh, this is one of the... This is a shop room. You can buy stuff from here. Like, if I have 208 copper on me, uh, which I might do, you can buy that sort of thing. Um, we don't have time to buy anything. We're not really... We're not really in the market for stuff. Although, oh, this would have been a nice room to spend some time in uh, if we had found it earlier. But we don't know where our exit is yet. It's the only problem with elixir vaults is finding your way out is a nightmare. Uh, let's just keep running. This is no bueno. Come on, give me one. This is ridiculous. This is like truly ridiculous. There's my doorbell. Oh, there it is. Okay. Cool. Gen genuinely panicking. Um, that's fine. Okay, we can now loot a little bit. We can be a bit greedy. We've got a minute to kill. Uh, oh, come on. Come on. Speed is key when looting with a minute left. I'm feeling like maybe the reason it wasn't digging properly is I was using the wrong pick every time, but I'm not sure on that. Ooh, big boy. Oh, he takes, like, no knockback either. Uh, do you know what? Let's do this. I'm not dealing with you guys. Because this is just... Oh. See ya. Goodbye. Whew. That was stress. Um, claim. <laughs> Lovely. So I drop that for a second. Um, yeah, we did quite well there, I think, with stuff. Uh, we should also, if I press H, yeah, we've now done one um, Tenos Altar one and one Wendel. So if we scroll down... Oh, wait. Uh, I don't know. I don't fully know how it works, but we've done one and one. It's pretty good. Uh, we did quite well in that vault, I would say at least. We'll put this down for a second. Uh, we'll put these down for a second. Uh, let's come over here and just do that to clear as much of my inventory as possible. We didn't really do that well on the ores, and that's not the greatest. Oh, what's in the shop? Oh, a mod box. I mean, we could afford one. How much have we got? Five? We could definitely buy one. Let's buy one. They're always nice to buy. Um, and we'll we'll keep it with the rest of them for now. Um, let's now whiz out as much of this as possible. Let's open our crate though. Ooh, anything good looking? Shoveling? Eh, eh. I mean, we'll roll the gear. Oh, we roll the relics as well. Um, oh, and this I think picked up some stuff, right? Yeah, it did. Did this one? No. Oh wait, it did. A diamond. Lovely. Uh, we can come over here and just bash that, put that in there. Let's roll this real quick, get some more regular diamonds, uh, and then we'll roll our gear. Uh, put that away. We've got this. We can take this. We can put this. Oh my god, so much to do from one crate. It's wonderful. Put these in here for a second. So, let us roll away. I'm kind of hoping the sword isn't better because we've gone through a couple swords now. What are we really looking for an upgrade on? I don't think much. Okay. The sword uh, is not better. That's good. The shield 
I just don't think you'll compare to a rare when it's not in that same class. Mm. No, no way. No way. Oh, well that's, yeah, I've not beaten the legendary armor roll. No, and no. None of that is winning against my current gear. We've got actually pretty good gear. Um, Hiya! Um, put this away for a second. Uh, wait, can we make these new picks now? Wood dick mass. What is this? Perfect Wootenite surrounded by... Right. Uh, well... Let's have a quick look at this. Wait. Uh, one, two... These are perfect ones, right? Yeah. Two of these. Uh, oh, my god. Uh, what happened? Okay. I was like, where is that crate gone? So, we can make these now. And these go in here with chromatic steel ingots. Okay, wait. Uh, how many do we need? Nine. Ugh. Uh, okay, so we're gonna need some of you, some of you, some of you, some of you. Uh, let's do that to do that to do that that. Can we now make the new picks? Oh, we can! Level 20 has unlocked all of this. So we can actually make a... with 150 capacity. Okay, now we're talking. It's a bit of a shame, really, that we just, uh... <laughs> just remade this. But, I would like to consider making... using this on a pick. I am a little torn. I reckon that all fits on a pick. Uh, axing. With 32 capacity still left. That's pretty good. We could, we could definitely just straight replace this one already. Um, let's put this... Let's keep, we, we will keep this, because it's a good pick, don't get me wrong. Um, I just want the copiously because of, um... The fact that we need more special, um, we need more gems, obviously. Uh, oh, wait, no. Uh, that efficiency, silk touch, unbreaking. Um, we need more gems, uh, like, uh, to make pogs. And copiously gives us a 2% chance to get more, but in the grand scheme of things, that's still a really good percent chance. Um, I think we're just going to run out of the vault, though. Uh, well, we could check this, actually. Wait. So we are looking to get two more. Right? Because we need... We want six. So we're actually so close. Uh, we can take this and this for a second. And if we make one of these... Surrounded by these. Surrounded by these? Wait, is it one of... One of these? Surrounded by... Yeah, surrounded by these makes that. Then we can take this and surround again. And now we only need... Let's put these away. So seven. So we need nine times... Well, one, isn't it? Just nine. Okay, we can definitely do that. Let's get to work on that. Uh, uh, so that's the crystal done. We've put this away. So we've got our bag. Let's get our... Uh, get these. Lovely. Uh, and I think we're ready to go. This one, this one, this one. Yeah, let's go. So we've got a new pick. That's quite cool. 
That is very cool. Another elixir. And it's trapped. Oh, this is not a nice vault. But this has disarm chance, so maybe if we... We're not opening chests with that, though, so... We just live with it, apparently. That's all we're going to do. Uh, maybe I'd like to finish this vault quite quickly. I don't really want to be in this vault. We need nine knowledge, and that's all we're here for, pretty much. Uh, that and dig sites. Uh, so, let's see what we can find. I do like the pirate theme. It is cool. We could do a speeding this pickup maybe a little bit. I don't know. I don't know how much faster it could be on chests. Like, will it ever get... Oh, well, there's a way out in the first room. That is great to see. Uh, this side actually doesn't lead to anything. Do you think I can... Ooh, just... Drowns. Scourge. Oh, hello. Ow. Ow, he's naming me. Oh my god. Oh no. All of our stuff's gone. Um... How do we get our stuff back? Um, wait, how do we get our stuff back? Uh, they killed me quick. Um, I think we should have all of that. Let's make this. Didn't think we'd die so quickly after hitting level 20. Oh, we've completed a quest, apparently. Oh, okay, here. Spirit Extractor is used to recover loot within vaults. If you die, pick up your spirit by sneak right-clicking on it. Place it onto the Spirit Extractor. Okay, right, so... We did that for the quest. It was just for the quest. Um, I purposely did that. In... Oh. Got it. Okay. Uh... No. Cost to recover items. 30% of gold. I don't understand. Is this, is this enough? Cost of recovering items, 30% vault gold of 13. You want more? I'm unsure what's happening here. Oh, okay. Oh my god, okay. Oh, I see. 40, oh, I see, okay. That gives everything back. Alright, well that was fun. That was sad. That made me very sad. Uh, Soulbound means more fun now, apparently. Um, cool, we, we got nothing. Uh, and we actually got so jibbed. Uh, we lost so much gold, and now gold is the most valuable thing to me in the world, because it means re retrieving our stuff. Which is great. Uh... Okay, so what have we learnt? Nothing. We've learnt nothing. We're going back in. Let's give it another go, because that was horrible. Um, but we did it for the quest. We needed to do that to progress. 100%. Uh, very plain vault, not trapped. Elixir vault again. Let's see if we can do better. Oh, we didn't bring any blocks. No real ores to be dug here, unfortunately. Come on, honestly. Oh my god. Speed boy. What was that? Cheese. Oh, we're getting uh, cheese for the burgers now. Okay. That's really cool to see. So cheese is just another additive to the burgers, basically. 
that you can use to basically make them um, worth more experience, which is really cool. Uh, let's pop up here. Oh. Hello. Lovely. Oh my god, they're just dropping down. I can hear them in the background. Hello. Man alive. Okay, right. Uh, let's let's go. I think. Oh, we didn't know there might be an upstairs, but again, is there going to be digging upstairs? Probably not. It was quite an open room. Yeah, not a huge amount of an upstairs area. Uh, let's just let's just hit it and go. Hit it and quit it. I don't know if the copiously really triggered on any of those ores. It normally makes a ding, but I've noticed that I am prone to probably not noticing things as much as I maybe should do when playing. <laughs> um, right, let me chuck all of this away, and then we'll we'll try and deal with the rest of our stuff. So, crack this open a couple nice little bits uh, let's see uh, oh we need to do our bags as well shoveling horrible shoveling horrible axing horrible durability meh okay all kind of meh and we're ready to roll let's see if we get anything good Ooh, rhino boots uh, so, no, no, they're not bad because they've, they've rolled for four extra armor, although these have rolled for three with, yeah, no, I, I think we're still going to keep what we've got. Uh, this... No. And this... No. I want that. I want that, I want that, I want that, I want that. Now, we have enough to do this, to do... this, to do this... Da 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 da... Oh. Wait, 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 wait. <laughs> ah, sixth knowledge. It's taken us a long time to get here. And this is where I start to question whether this is the right decision or not. I think it is, but I just think create is the best one. So now that's 16, yeah. Ugh. Christ. But now, if I just... Let's just get rid of all of this. Yay! Uh, let's pull all of this away. Now we can do stuff with create, though. Just trying to work out where I want to at least start the basic stuff. Let's start over here. Okay. So, if we want water wheels, we want to do this. And we want to do this. One, two, three. Uh, okay, and then we want to do this. So water wheels are, are funny. Well, not funny. You just need to make sure that you are placing the water correctly. Because you want the blades to be maximizing the water. So, I think that you want it so that the water is touching every part of the water wheel. Um, so if I then dig this out for a second, the water will finish there, and then we want the water to... Hello? Okay, that was a bit confusing. Uh, we don't want the water to come this way. We want it to solely go that way. 
So let's see if we've done this correctly. If I place the water here, yes. And I think we can attach, yeah, see the water's properly spinning there. Um, that's good, that's good, that's good. So, then we can come here and I just want to just break that one. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Now we can come here and we can say, we can take, is it? How do I make a, uh, right, first off, chest, place this down over here. Put away all of this junk for a second, because uh, it's cluttering my mind when I'm looking inside. I want to make a cog, right? So, yeah, so this is what I want as well, shafts. Okay, shafts require that, cogs require layer mark, got it. Okay, so we're gonna need some layer mark as well. Right, mechanical press. So that's our press done. So now we can come back up here. And I can then take off of here power. Well, actually, let's do this. Ooh. Uh, let's do that. Let's take a big cog first. Then we'll put it into a little cog, because if we use gearing, we can basically speed up our um, our... Oh, that is running too fast for a little cog now. That's fine though, but now we should be able to do this, this, and then this. Might be too high. I don't know. Uh, we need gold. Uh, I don't know if this has to be done one at a time or not. Oh, it has to be done one at a time, but it will hold the whole stack. So we couldn't speed this up, which is a bit of a shame. Someone look to be going faster? No. Um. Seven. Okay, what do we need for this? Glass, string, yeah, that's fine. Yeah, we can make all of this back downstairs real quick. It's just gonna be a little bit of, uh, like, way of living boosts. Uh, so we need string, yeah. Glass, yeah. Which will be the goggles done, which we can actually just equip to our, oh my god, our head. Yeah, sure thing. Uh, so that's them done. Then this, we should be able to just make. Lovely, that will make it a bit easier to live. And then a chest and leather is all we want. So chest, done, leather, done. And now we can do this, which can hold all of our gears and stuff. Uh, let's sleep. And now we should be ready to dominate the world of create. If we come up here, we can then put this down and we can put our cogs in here and our shafts in here. There we go, lovely. So, this is finished processing the rest of this. That is good. So, we've done this, 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 and we've done this. So, if we look at create, there's a couple different things we can use. What? Will this double all? Just want to check. Uh, it doesn't look like it, that's fine. Um, yeah, there's a couple different things we can do. We could, 
we could set up a load of encased fans to be able to um, You know what, just take it all. Um, we should be able to see the stress of this now, yeah. So, at current speed, 256. 256, yeah. So the only reason we can't speed this up is because we don't have more of these. But we could put, like, another three and increase the stress. Or we could make something like a windmill, which is, it needs a... There's a bearing that you can use. Uh, what you can do is you can come here and you can look at the ponder index and you can kind of have a look at um, all of these sorts of things. So we can go to hand cranks, copper valve handles. So we're using water wheels currently, windmill bearing, steam engines, and then the creative motor. So we could do a windmill bearing, which is the bearing attaches to the block in front of it and you build a windmill using glue. If enough sails like blocks are included, this can act as a windmill and it will spin and generate force, basically. Um, so that's one thing we could do. Um, the steam engine's really good, but you do need to be able to make like a blaze burner, which is an empty blaze plus hitting a blaze with it, I, I don't fully know. Um, empty blaze burner. I mean, like, we could make one and we could try. Because um, that basically cooks the, the boiler. Um, just trying to think, though. Because there's a couple things that I'd like to do. I'd like to set up the tree farm so that it just constantly generates wood and charcoal for us. Um, which I think would be quite nice. Uh, hmm. This is going to take some some thought, I think. Uh, how much is it to make another? It's, it's just the fact that it's the chromatic steel that annoys me more than anything. Um, mechanical mixer. Are we going to need this for anything? Oh, automated brewing. Right mixing to make potions of healing. Oh, golden apple plus awkward potion. They're not too bad. Uh, builder's tea, nice. Fluix crystals, oh we might need this for AE anyway. Dough. Oh, we make lava. Superheated. Plus a blaze cake. Do you have to constantly feed it blaze cakes? I don't know. Um, Yeah, so I mean, we've unlocked this now at least. Six left to do. We'll, we'll leave it at that for now. Because um, we can also make uh, like harvesting of plants and stuff as well. Um, there's like so much that we can do with this mod. Uh, we just need to maybe get a really good infrastructure sorted, which I think means making uh, the fluid tank the oh my god what's happening pumps i think it means i think we want to make the big um steam engine i think that's the like best thing we could do uh, which needs i think it needs a mechanical arm to feed the thing coal because you feed this coal which needs this um, and you pump water in, uh, and I think this would be a, a really good way for us to get started. How much is like stuff like this? Yeah, I mean like pff, copper and tanks, let's go get a load of copper then, because I think we're going to need a lot of it. Um, uh, copper. But again, I've done plenty of mining, so we have tons of copper. So let's chuck this into the press. 
We could also do with maybe just trying to speed the press up by making another three of these. Um, let's see about doing that. Did we have any? No, we didn't. Um, do this and that, spread that, done, then, oh wait, no, 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 uh, that's there, that's there, that's there, we do that, we're going to need three more buckets of water, which is probably the most annoying part of this recipe, uh, but we have plenty of water around the base, so it's not the biggest issue. Uh, And then we can take these up, and if we just extend that setup along, I think then we should be able to speed this design up. Oh, okay. Wait. I thought that made an infinite. Uh, ba -ba 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 -ba. Still 256. Okay. But now can I come in here and do this and this? Still doesn't want to do that. Um. We could make was it called? Was it cooled? Could make a rotational oh my god, we could not make a rotational speed controller. <laughs> um Surely we can I don't understand why we can't gear this. Uh, let's go and sleep real quick. 18 I think because that can make me a very big boiler then uh, so we can come back up this way I'm basically looking for the bamboo at this point um, and we can say this was our first thing let's go do you know what? let's do it next to here actually because we are going to need access to the water uh, let's just make this a a decent pool. Uh, so let's do it here, for example. One, two, one, two, one, two, one, two, and then, oh, there we go. So this is our big old fluid chamber. We then want these, which is fluid pipes plus a small cog. Fluid pipes are made with copper and other copper. Got it, that's fine. Uh, we want some Cooper, and I want to make a hand crank. One of these, I can make one, that's fine. Uh, could do with doing this actually, and just bringing one of these with me as well. Because uh, what you want to do is you're going to need to hand crank initially uh, to get going do that then we do we need a small gear let's just make another one uh, shaft small gear I hate that it uses lemma hate uh, but that's fine so then I can put the pump I think here and then the pipe into here and that and then I just need another small baby gear to connect to there. And then I think that 
we'll put some water in there. No, because this is reverse directions. I need it to face that way. Right. This should pump water now. Maybe not. Ponder. Fluid manipulation. Mechanical pump. Yeah. Arrow indicates the direction of flow. Oh, uh, wait, so we want. Yeah, no, that's right. Direction of flow is this way. In less weight, let's, um. Ponder again real quick. Uh, regardless of the speed, connected up to 60, uh, mechanical, okay, yeah. Maybe we're not pulling fast enough. Uh, wait, if we then instead, just because I can, I can afford to make them here, let's do this quickly, then uh, uses, uh, recipes, I just need a perfect layer mark, yeah, uh, um, wait, uh, that one is what I want. If we do, wait. So, you want small to be the last one, right, yeah, 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 you want it to be small, but I'd like it to be up, can it be up, oh, it could be, if I, up on an angle. Small, big, small, that's now faster, is it pulling water yet? I think I can make these clear so I can see. Does it need to be too deep? Or is it? Is it just because? No, wait. Does it need to be too deep? I'm so baffled. Is this facing the right way? Because these ones aren't sources. Just trying to work this out. And I will work this out. Ah, there we go. There we go. Okay, so it wasn't deep enough. That's fine. Um, now we're collecting water. So... Could I have just, if I, wait, could this have just been hand cranked? Uh, would this have worked? Oh, but it's sucking water now. Okay. Yeah, it can. I just need lots of hand cranking. But if you look, water is going, and then it's in. Okay, right. That's fine. So this contains water. So what we need to do is then we need to heat this water up using one of these. Um, and then we feed it with a mechanical arm which is gonna need this 
Um, right, five times. That's not the worst. We just might want to make one of these setups. Okay, right, that's fine. We're, we're now getting somewhere. Okay. But what we're going to do is I think we're going to come back and do this next time so that then we can spend a bit more time on this because this has been quite a long episode already. So thank you very much for watching. I hope you enjoyed. I hope you liked the progress we made today and I will see you guys in the next one. Oh wow, you've actually made it this far. Okay, um, three things. Um, don't forget to maybe watch another video. I don't know which side I'm on. These ones, this or this, there's a box with a video. Um, consider subscribing and maybe like the video. Leave a comment, I'll, I'll say hello. Anything, go, go wild.